and we are back. So, um, I did just die here. Uh, <laughs> there's a clip where basically my audio failed. Um, so we died. Uh, we had to re-equip ourselves and get everything sorted. Um, I might try and play that clip now really quickly. Hello, and we are back for more insane craft. So, we already set out what we want to do. So let's get working on probably the first thing we're going to need. Ew, I think the first thing we could do with is a second shovel because we're going to need one. So let's just do that, get ourselves a second shovel because we're going to need a lot of resources anyway. But we also need an easy way up here. Oh no. What's happening? Ha! Huh, what's happening? What? Audio has started to come out of my uh, speakers. Uh, one second. But what we have to do, as I was trying to do in that clip, is one, climb up here and get some wood so that we can start working on... Ooh, maple. Okay. Uh, so we can start working on our um all of the the objectives we set just at the end of last episode so this is the start of day two obviously oh yeah we're dinging our axe somehow or cutting ability not sure um what that means but that's fine um oh, i see you go on son boom get me some blocks why not a little bit of a cheap way to do it, but it works. So I think after we've cut down a couple more trees, we'll probably have enough um, to get started at least. Ooh, ooh. That's the tree I want to cut down. Uh, to be able to make our like uh, wooden stuff initially, because we've got a couple wooden tables to make. Um, I've not actually played any of this in the background. Maybe I should make a test world to try work out some of the stuff we were questioning in the the first episode. But ugh, that sounds like you know, sounds like preparedness, and that is one thing we are not prepared for anything. Um, cool, dig down here. We are going to need to find some clay and some. We're level two at moving. I don't even know what mod that is. But we're good, doing so good at moving. Um, so, let's first off make a crafting table like this. And let's maybe dig into the wall here. And we'll start to set up some of our Tinker's stuff. So, Tinker's crafting table. Right, done. Stencil table is just a stencil. That's fine. So let's do... We need that, then we need that, we'll do this for a second, that'll get us plenty of stencils, uh, so then we do a couple more of these, and then this will be our stencil table, so we can do this, then I'm pretty sure to make the other table we do this, yeah, so that's stencil table and part builder. Then we need the tool station, which again, not too hard. We can just do this, and then I presume that. Lovely. How do we make the these? Okay, so the pattern chest is quite simple, and the parts chest not too bad either. So let's just make a couple chests. Uh, bam, bam. Then this will make... Oh my god, I don't know what those explosions are. I'm thinking it's the wizards that keep roaming around and killing me, but could never tell. Uh, and then let's make the parts chest as well. Right, so now we should be able to do... So I think the best way to do it is this. Part builder, tool station. Then we break out the back of these two and we put parts chest and pattern chest. So now when we open this, oh well we have access to all of it anyway, 
Well, that's really annoying, but that's fine. So then we can come here and we can put all of this in here. And now we can make all of our stencils we need. So let's put some of our stuff away for a second because we're going to make a lot of stencils. Um, just for the sake of having everything, it makes sense just to do it all once. Um, and that way we don't have to come back to anything. Uh, even though we might not use them all, at least we'll have them available to us without complaining. Uh, and now we're one step closer to being able to make some cool stuff. I wonder if making a shovel this way, because we're going to have to do a lot of digging now to get all of our um, clay and gravel and stuff. I wonder if making a tinker shovel would be better than a regular shovel. I don't know. Uh, this one. What is that noise? The hunt for blood begins. I'm sorry. What? Uh, okay. Just gonna ignore that. I think that, that sounds like a bad time. Um, a time that I don't want to deal with a huge amount. Oh yeah, we can make Tinker's armor, can't we? Yes, yes, yes. I forget this. Put all of these in here. Cool. Um... Shoot, what was the last... Oh, the last thing we did was the this one. There we go. So we do this. Then we do this. Then we do this. 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 And this. And then that should be the rest of the patterns done. What I'd like to do right now... What the hell is this? A silkworm egg. Oh, okay. What I'd like to do, I think, is... Uh, build a wall, because <laughs> goddamn is it terrifying uh, here. So let's just maybe like build a bit more of a whatever that is, and then we'll maybe even go as far as making a door. Let's just door. Lovely. Feel a little bit safer now, and let's pop this up one because I'm getting annoyed by the stuff that's stuck over here and the height is a little bit annoying right so we can tick a fair few bits off of our list now which is nice uh, yeah let's keep it fairly tidy still Right, so we can actually make armor, which I completely forgot about. Um, which might be very cool. Um, oh, we can't make armor yet. Not in this station, at least. Unless is there a... Um, uh, or a, is there like a different station we need for armor? Let's just have a quick look. Stencil, 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 stencil. That all looks fairly similar. Tool forge, stencil, part builder. Not seeing anything that looks like it's different for armor. So I think we're good. I think we've built everything we need. So we can take this off the list now. This is gonna be a, a long end project. Ooh, ooh. For now, oh yeah, we can claim chunks. Let's claim this around us, sure. And then, can we, oh, I see. Can we then, uh, is it like shift? Chunk load, cool. Um, so the little area around us is chunk loaded, um, which is nice. Uh, then we can come to J, is it? Yeah, J, close this. Waypoints, remove, remove. Let's put a new one just for home save right so home is here got it so now we need to start harvesting for our grout so we need sand gravel and clay okay so 
long as death isn't after us, we've got stuff around here already. Um, sand and gravel's fairly abundant. Clay is what I'd need to find. Please don't come for me, death. Is this clay? This looks like clay. This is some clay. Lovely. Right. Mind that out. Because um, we'll do the gravel and stuff last. I think do clay first. Because it's the hardest bit of this to find. Uh... Yeah, it's quite hard to find, isn't it? We could do it maybe a boat just to whiz around and look for clay. Um, I don't think that's clay, is it? No. Let's make a little boat real quick. Um, a quick little boat. And let's go see if we can find some clay. Should we work out roughly how much we want? So if this makes eight, and then uses for that, that turns into one. So that makes two bricks per. I think at a bare minimum, we need to make one block in the middle, two blocks. I think you can make a one by like one, um, two blocks and then a controller and a thing. So we don't need that much. I don't think if, if I am right about how small we can make it, that w that wasn't a number, admittedly. Oh, no. What's making these noises? Let's dig our way through here. Connect the land. What's making those noises? What is it? What's making these noises? These foul sounds. Oh, come on. Boats are a bit fiddly, eh? We'll break it. No harm. Uh, cool. Oh, that's stone. Okay. Struggling to tell the difference fully, but that's fine. I think we've got a good vein here. Yeah, this might be as much gravel as we need. Not gravel, uh, clay. Oh my god, honestly, not a clue what's detonating on a regular occasion here. Um, it's a little terrifying. I will I will put that forwards. This is a... Some sort of cave? Oh, man. Okay, I mean, it's, it's not a bad cave to explore, but we don't actually want to... Uh, get involved, but the coal's going to be very useful because we're going to need to cook all this grout. So, a little bit of coal. The hell is that thing? A little bit of coal didn't hurt anybody. Saying that though, it might hurt me seeing whatever that giant bastard is over there. Christ. Don't come for me, sir. The pickup range is awful right now, isn't it? Okay. What are you? Can you see me? You can see me! Holy Christ! Okay. He saw me. And that was my fault. Fair play. Uh, I see a lot more clay over here. Um, so actually, we're probably good. Let's try and get like... If we can get what, four stacks? So we get a stack of clay blocks in total. That would be quite good. I now know what's making those explosions though. It's whatever that guy is. Uh, let's take a breath for a second. And back down. Yeah, I mean, better shovel would have been nice for this, but that's fine. I actually don't know if there's danger in the water. I'm down here very casually, but this could be the end of me. Um, where are we at currently? Two stacks? Okay. And back down. Man, you need to stop exploding everything. You're terrifying me. This game has me in a panic, and we're not getting a lot from food right now. Which is not great. 
Uh, let's go back up. Blood Hunters Retreat. Satisfied. I don't know what they were, but they didn't touch us, and that is all I need to know. We need to eventually find out what they are, I'm sure, but Blood Hunters don't sound like they're going to be like, ooh, the best thing for Ollie. Um, clay should be quite easy to... Uh, not clay. Um, gravel should be quite easy to get, because we can do the torch trick, hopefully, and just kind of drop it all onto a torch. Um, and then we won't have to waste as much time um, digging. And we can do the same with sand, actually. So I guess it's only clay that we have to kind of do the long way with, which is not too bad. I'm going to probably go up when I've got two bubbles of air left, like now. Yeah, see? Smart. Swimming's not as fast. Uh, lovely. Let's get the rest of this dug up. And then that should probably put us to what we're aiming for um, in terms of clay. And then it's just move on to doing the gravel and sand. And then we should be able to get into Tinkers this episode fairly nicely. We're going to need some lava, um, but that will mean digging, which we need to do anyway. Uh, let's swim back up. One, two, three, four. Lovely. Right. Let's see if we can do our little trick then with some gravel. Because there's a fair bit around here. Um, and we've kind of got to open that cave up a little bit, I guess. Um, so, if we make a torch. Right. Let's see. So, how deep does this go? Okay, not too bad. Yes, we can. This is going to be easy. And probably we want what? Yeah, so we want four stacks of uh, gravel as well to be able to make the equal amount of gravel to clay to sand. That's fine. Gravel will come nice and quickly with this method. Ooh. Lovely. Oh, and we'll get flint as well, which is nice, I guess. Um, we're all about efficiency. Sometimes you're too efficient. Uh, you want to get it just as it begins to fall, otherwise it can sometimes replace the supporting block. Like that. Too quick there. Uh, that's fine. Where are we at so far? Uh, almost a stack. Okay. It's a little bit slower than I hoped, but not the worst. Ah, come on. Gimme. Give Gimme give some bigger rows. More like rows of, like, five. Oh, torches. Am I missing a torch? Oh, no. Well, uh, the bigger rows, I think, are up here. Maybe not. I think it's still the threes. I'm holding the brake button still. <laughs> God damn. Uh, okay, where are we at? A stack. What we could do, because it's going to be a kind of time consuming process either way, is if we've got a stack now, we need some sand, and then we can start to. Um, sand's over there. If we do the same tactic with sand, get a stack, we can start smelting some of it down. So we're not wasting so much of our time waiting for things to smelt afterwards. Yes. Smart. Let's see if we can get out of this boat properly. Yeah, we can. Okay. Kind of. It's a little bit laggy, but that's fine. Uh, try and dig in a little bit to where maybe there's like three stacks. Uh, Maybe over here, more likely. Yeah, this is looking better. Okay, wait, no. I mean, sure. I don't think that's much better, but... We save ourselves a little bit of time, right, I guess?
Come on. Give me some bigger stacks, no? I guess not. We could do with going up to the slime island at some point as well. Maybe we just dig. Maybe the torch method is just not as efficient with like smaller stacks. Although we did just break our torch, so our shovel. That is a uh, one thing to consider. Uh, oh, oh, okay, we go. Let's make some grout then, and at least get it smelted down. We need to venture into there at some point, because it does look to be some good stuff, and we're gonna need. Resources, obviously, to smelt. Um, so, it is going to be a challenge at some point, but for now, not. Um, right. Give me that to make that. Right, so that's made us two stacks currently. Oh, that might be enough, to be fair. Um, let's do this. Put this here that there. Let's now go to that cave for a second then, because that might be enough stuff in general. Two stacks is quite a lot to get us started. And we can have a look at what's in here. Like I see iron, coal. Let's just try and clear this out a little bit. Ow. What are you? Shielding? No. No. Stop shielding. He's going to kill me. He's going to kill me. Die. 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 Damn it. We go back and get our stuff. I think that looks like a good place to maybe... What is... Oh, that's, I thought that was like a ship of some, some sort for a second. I think it's just a cliff. Um, but we go back into here to get some stuff. I think it's actually probably quite a, a good little... Come on. Die. Come on. You can't shield everything. Finally. Oh. Okay. All right. Iron ore. We can T. Oh, okay. Um, chance to get an enchanted key on death. I think that's what we want. Enchanted keys let you teleport back to your grave. Um, so you don't have to run back. So it's a little bit better. We can also grab this, which will allow us to start with Thorncraft once we've got some redstone, I think, is what that book said. Um, so that's quite handy. We just need a bookshelf as well, but I think we've got a bookshelf from the house that we raided at the start. Um, can't remember. We'll have to have a little look through our bag of stuff. Let's get some more coal as well, because we're still going to need to smelt some stuff. Because we are going to need to smelt some of that iron initially to be able to get a bucket. Um, to be able to get some of the... Uh, lava that we need. We might even need a way to make a tank of some sort. That might be a useful thing. Quartz? Sure. Uh, hello? I'm not here to disturb anyone. Just here for some goodies. Don't come and hurt me if you are here. Ooh, more iron. I see it. Nice. Grab all of that. Okay, shoot. Right, we're gonna have to come back with another pick. But this feels like a nice place to raid at least. What? The oh, that's death. We've dealt with death. We killed him with our bare hands before. Bear that in mind. We're pretty much badasses. We've only died like 19 times or something. Uh, any of these crops ready? I think they are, you know. Uh. Nope, wasn't ready. They're ready, though. Some carrots. 
eat those. Get us some strength, at least. Christ. Uh, we have not eaten rotten flesh before. Let's do it. I know it's not good, but it's another thing to add to our have eaten um, list of things. Uh, we can put these away now. So what ores did we get previously? Copper, copper. Um, right, L limonite, whatever that is. Jade. Nothing useful, useful. Okay, so we could do with another furnace. Uh, just to smelt some uh, iron down. Put that in there, and that'll at least get us the iron we need. We can even probably take out, leave only two in there, because we're eventually going to be able to double our resources once we have this smeltery up and running. Um, do we see any, oh wait, uh, Jay? Do we see any lava on the map at all? Uh, I don't understand. Oh, okay. Maybe that? I don't understand. I don't understand that map at all. Uh, is it because I'm underground currently? If I come out... Ah, there you go. That's what I wanted. J. Uh... I mean, I don't see any above ground lava. Above ground lava would be nicer than below ground. Quite simply because below ground seems dangerous as hell. Um, is there a way to make a tank of some sort? We could do with a tank. Well, actually, I think, if I'm not mistaken, the, um, the tank from... Tinkers will actually carry stuff for us anyway. Um, we need to smelt a sand apparently as well for that. I didn't realise that at the time. That's fine. Let's just bash this with our hands. With our goddamn hands. Okay. Let's smelt that up real quick. Oh, come on. We might need to just... There we go. Uh, take some doors. Take a sand. Um... Right, so now we can make one of you initially, and we need to make another pick actually. God damn it, need another pick, really. Um, and we need to dig into the wall again. So, hopefully, if I mine a three by three here, I should be able to fit it into that three by three. Um, because I'm hoping I can do what I think I can do, you know, the things and stuff. Ooh, is that iron? Ooh, that is iron. Lovely. That's made me very happy. Uh, iron. Give me that iron. Give me more. Give me more. I can see that mining is going to take up a lot of inventory space, because... Oh no, it's all converted into just regular iron ore. Okay, well that's good. So I'm thinking I can do one of you here. Uh, then one of you, like, here. Then I think we're going to need another block one here. Then we need the controller. So we've done the tank, we need the controller, which needs a furnace, that's fine, we can do that. Uh, right, then you, this is going to be a very small, um, why can't I shift? What's happening? Shift, okay, there you go. Uh, break you, and then I should be able to do a... I think it's just like that, yeah, one of you here, and then one of you on here. Is this a valid structure? Mm, it's not. Seared furnace controller, right, 
Do I want like wait smeltery? Uh. Oh wait, I want smeltery controller. Shoot, we've wasted some, but that's fine. If we break this, right, and then put this here, and then this. Okay, so it's valid now. It is valid. Um, we could try and make it a little bigger, um, but at least we know we've got a working smeltery. So anything we now do to make it, well, actually, first off, we need one of you and one of you. So these are our two, um, like, either casting uh, parts or casting blocks. So if we wanted to make it bigger, we could definitely do that, I think. I think that should be enough to make it slightly bigger, which might be nice. Uh, put one here, then we need two here. Then we need another two. Trying not to waste the bricks just yet. Um, there we go, and then come out and put that there. Yeah, okay, so a little bit bigger makes it much easier to work with. Um, so now all we need is lava. So actually we wanna take this with us and we want to chuck away basically all of this stuff. Um, oh yeah, we can't see the chest anymore, can we? That sucks. Um, we do want to just put all of this away though, as much as possible. Uh, in fact, probably just making another chest so we can get away with not losing stuff. Uh, do that. All of the, oh, what was the enchantment? Recharge four. I mean, that feels like a very good enchantment. Um, we do need this because we need to make a bucket. Okay, and now we need to find lava. And I'm wondering if there's a down path in this little cave over here where we can go down and get lava because it would be nice. What day are we on? Day three currently going into day four. Let's see if we can find a little little route down. This goes down. We can collect some iron as we go, because I mean this is what we'll make our initial tools out of if we can. Really hoping it's not bad, bad down here. Ooh, that looks bad. I don't know if there's a better way to find lava. Um, but I'm feeling like going down is not the way for us. Um, we might have to go lava hunting in the next episode because I'm feeling like we need to work out what we're doing for that. So let's finish. Oh, we finally achieved Stone Age. Oh, wait. Oh, stone. Oh, we haven't seen this before. Lovely. A bit of, a bit of stone. That's nice. Oh, wizard. Wizard, no. Evil wizard. Marble from Astral. Okay, this cave's full of a lot of good stuff. I will give it that. It's gonna bring down all of that, but that's fine. Just trying to scope out the area. Limonite, so we've got an ingot of this already. Not too sure what it's for, but we'll pick it up anyway. So what we need is lava now. Maybe there's a way to make lava, meaning we don't have to go like to the depths of hell to achieve such a thing. Uh, copper is also good. Um, and I think we can make some nice tools out of it. If not armor, we can make some copper armor in Tinkers, I think. Uh, coal, very useful. I feel like we've done a lot better the second two days, now that we're a bit more aware 
of uh, what's happening. And we found cobble. Uh, that was a, a key milestone for us. Or we found cobble alternatives, to be more precise. Uh, I don't think we have the ability to dig everything right now. Ooh, nope. Flee. We also don't have that much food either to keep ourselves... <gasps> Lava! At least one will do us. That will help a lot. That will help a mighty amount. In fact, part of me thinks greed needs to stop and we need to go back home once we get this iron here. Oh, more stone as well. Oh, honestly, this cave, full of the best stuff. I want just the extra iron, because hopefully this will double. Oh, a beautiful little vein. If this doubles, we'll be looking golden for iron, because that's 20 there if it doubles. There is more down here. Hello? Hello? I just have to think about getting as much as possible so that we can at least get a bit better equipped and not feel so um, so weak, because that's how I'm feeling right now. Weak and scared. And I don't want to feel scared anymore. I want to feel like a champion in this world. And iron is the way forwards. There you go. So that's now like 40 iron, basically. Uh... Let's go back up. Oh, that's the explodey boy. He'll detonate us from a distance quite happily. No remorse. Ooh, another piece of iron. Ooh, a piece of candy. That's fine. Oh man, we were so lucky to find a little bit of like, not super deep eye, uh, lava. We go back this way, keep our eyes peeled any more iron but I think that is everything we go this way right yeah this way is the way out what's this mushroom that was an explosion down there don't know what's going on what is this <gasps> whoa you had like half a heart you can't do me like that nope nope the hell? Go on. Die. Okay, right. Now you. Yeah, that's right. Fungi boy. We got your name, son. Uh, right. Let's see if iron doubles first. That would be... <gasps> what are you? He came for us from the sky. Bear that in mind. Crikey. Um, close this door for a second. So we've got some uncommon loot. Oh, okay. Um, so we do have one gold, which means we can make one permanent cast as well. Um, but let's put the lava in here and let's test. So we put one iron in. Let's see how much iron we get out. We're fingers crossed for two. And let's, while we wait, let's look up lava. Lava. Uh, so it can be created in a light well. Magmatic crucible, that. Fluid exchange, that, uh, that, that. Nothing really useful for us. Okay, that's fine then. Not easy to make. Um, mob drops. Oh, okay. Uh, in a crucible. Ooh. Thorncraft. We can make lava. Interesting. Lava egg comes from lava chickens. Or we could do chickens as well in this. Okay. There's a lot of interesting... Okay. Two. Yes. Okay. That's fine. Right. So, we can at least start to get some iron going. In which case, 
should we make a... I think the best thing to do would be to make a... If we put this in here and we make a stone pick head, right? Then we put this away. Then we put this here, right? Then we take our iron here, our gold. And then once this is finished smelting, we'll put our gold in and make a gold template. I think. So we put this in. This should smelt really quickly because it's gold. Oh, it, it bottled out for heat for a second. Don't know what happened there. Uh, we are using this lava very quickly though. But we now have one block and one ingot in there. So now if we put this on the bottom and we pour this out, we'll make an ink, we'll make a, right? Or does it need two? <gasps> I think it needs two. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Um, shoot. Right, let's quickly swim back over. See if maybe we can spot like one gold. That's very annoying though. Oh, the mod that makes these infinitely grow is also in, which is cool. Um, we're not going down there. What we're going to do is we're going to go down the side that we went over here. Oh, with all of this caved in, it's a little confusing, isn't it? Um, up here. Is this copper? Oh, it is. Oh, I see loads of people coming for us. They come. What the hell happened there? That guy went jumping. We are merchants of death. We kill everything. We're looking for like one gold. Because of course it doubles. And that would do us very good. Oh, hello. Zombie villager. Oh, he dropped uh, an ingot, I think. That's cool. Uh, copper, we're not super after right now. Oh, we've come down here with all of our iron as well. Really smart. Really smart. This is just to help us mine quicker, is why I've bought the iron pickaxe with us. Um... Lots of coal. Coal's very easy to find, at least. Uh, gold. 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 There. This is all we need. Oh, there's a little bit more as well. Greed. Greed has entered my heart. Okay, wait. Let's just be very careful. And I think let's just leave nice and calmly. Let's not greed too much right now because we want to make sure that we can make our stuff and then come back and greed later. Yes, okay. Just come back up nice and carefully. Don't let anyone spook you. Yes, I know I'm talking to myself, but that's okay. Ooh, I mean, it's right here. Oh no. Oh, there's something killing us. There's something killing us. And the greed. Oh, but this is, this is an enchanted key. So hold right click to teleport to your grave. And we're here, lovely. Uh, and we can click this and we can go. We just go, we just go. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. We just go. Whatever's 
coming for us right now. We just pretend like we don't know and we just go. Oh, there are things following me? I never knew. I never knew. <sighs> panic, panic. Yeah, through here. Another creeper, a skeleton. Everyone wants a piece of us. God damn, in the boat, in the boat. Go, 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 go. And we're out, people. And we've got basically a full stack of iron once it's been doubled. That's pretty sweet. Uh, we come over here. And now we've got enough gold to do multiple casts of things as well. So we can actually make some better tools, which is good. Um, let's also break down some of this. Lovely. We'll just plant more of it for the sake of it. We're not using it right now. What's what's going on? Bubbles. Uh, okay, get back in here for a second. This should have smelted down. Perfect. So now if we pour this out, how much we've got left? 650, okay. Yeah, so now it makes a template. So now we can take this, and because we've got more stuff, what I'll do is I'll come into here, and I'll actually make a bind and a tool rod and then we'll make patterns for these as well so a bind lovely and a tool rod because we can use these in here to make our stuff I think so now That's very annoying. Okay, well, they smelt back down. It's not It's not the worst. But we're not going to waste smelting that back down. Um, so now if I put this here, and I put iron on the bottom, it's going to not be a great pick, but we can now make an iron pick, full iron, which should be better than our current iron pick. And I think even with just a guard, if we made just a wide guard pattern, and again, unfortunately, we re-smelt this down. Uh, so this should allow us to make our pick, which is now magnetic and diamond mining level. I mean, it'll be slightly faster, I think, than what we've got. Um, but it's still a, a tinker's pick. Um, and then if we take our this and we item can't be molten. Molten. Oh. Have we just wasted two gold by accident? I think we have. Okay, well. Means we can't do the sword right now until we get some, some more gold. <laughs> I forgot. We had more. <laughs> That's fine, okay. I was a little bit sad, but we got it, it's fine. Um, so now we can make... Uh, how do you make an axe? Uh, just with the axe head? Could we do that as well? Maybe we could do that. Um, just trying to kind of get our basic equipment sorted. And the shovel, I guess, is shovel head? Could we do a shovel head? I reckon we can. Uh, lovely. So we do that. That'll make us a wide guard. We do that. That'll make us an axe head. Oh, and we do that, and that'll make us a shovel head, right? Uh, and now we can make with this plus this. Oh, wait, uh, and this is what we need as well. Because um, we need the rod, wide guard, and then the sword pattern. If we now come here, we should be able to fill the sword up. Sword. Let it cool down. Lovely. Then we should be able to do another um, one of those. While this is happening, let's put in a little bit more iron. 
what are we looking like? 550. We've used about half a bucket right now. Um, so we've done that. We need then the wide guard. Got it. Wide guard. And then we should be able to make ourselves a Tinker's Sword. Uh, if we come here, we should then be able to do that. Which again, they're not going to be the best swords, but 5 damage versus 6, it's a, it's a minor improvement. Um, 1.6, 1.6, and so, I mean, it's, it's a minor improvement. But we can upgrade these, is the main thing. Um, and then we can make our axe as well. So the axe, remind me, needed that plus that plus that, sure thing. So we can actually now put these bits away and even that away and we can do axe head, paw. Uh, we also don't need this part anymore or this part or this part. We're still going to need these parts for um, our things. We can actually just probably pour it fairly reasonably. Um, Pull all of this down here for a second as well. Um, even that. Uh, so that's the two heads done. Now we need two of the bindings. Binding one, uh, binding two, and then we're just going to need two rods, and that should be as sorted for. Tinker's stuff, and I think we have enough in here to do it all, and just about enough lava. We might need to spend next episode looking into um, doing something for lava, because we don't have an easy way to do it, but now we have access to Tinker's tools, we can actually, like, I don't know, the the easiest thing, I guess, to show this off is let's actually make a proper staircase up for a second. Uh, I mean, they're okay. They've got decent durability. Um, you just need an easy way back up to the surface, which is the thing that's been bugging me a little bit. But that's Tinker's done, technically. I mean, like, there's, of course, we still need to progress to having enough iron to make the table like the better version of the table. But we can come up here now, we can use our axe and just cut away at this tree. Not high enough, damn it. There we go. Tree cut down. Uh, we've still got the sword, which will do a little bit more damage. Um, I'd say that's a success though. Uh, I wouldn't say we've we've done badly there. Uh, let's just do that. And we've got a little tinker set up. So we have done grout, we have done bricks, we have done drain, we've done that, we've done that, we've done that, and we made that, but it was not It was a mistake. Arguably, we probably do have enough. So it's what, 9, 18, uh, so that's well. If I just do that, 18 iron should technically be enough to make uh, this, but I don't know if we have enough lava to do that right now. Um, but let's make a quick new uh, chest for ores, I think, then. Uh, we can put it just above here. And at least we can then focus on getting our ore situation a bit more sorted. Uh, ores and metals and stuff. And I think that's everything, right? Yeah. Cool. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Yeah, that looks to be everything. Cool. Well, that is days three and four done, because I think we're just waking up in the morning of four now. Which is cool. We did get another. Did we get another perk? No, we didn't. Um, that's fine. Um, we've got all sorts of stuff here. Monster kills. Oh, I see. Okay. 
don't know what's happening with that, but that's fine. I've just realized there's so many menus. Um, baubles, oh, okay. Oh my god, crazy. Um, so in the next episode, I think it would be good to try and get into one of the other mods. Um, maybe something like... We could try Thorncraft, but I think we need redstone. What about blood magic, maybe? Do we need redstone to get into blood magic? I think to start with, with blood magic, we need an altar, which needs demonic will and gold. Demonic will comes from sentient swords. So let's have a quick look. Uh, we need a sentient sword. Uh, oh, that comes from a health forge with a petty tartaric gem, which needs one redstone. We have one. I don't know if you need more than one, because if you need two to do it, we might struggle, because you need one here, I think. Um, so possibly, I, I don't know, but then we also need to make the... We could try and get into this. We've got the resources, I think, to start getting into this now, um, but we do need more redstone. So maybe the aim would be to make some more armor um, and go deeper underground. Um, that might not be the worst idea. Uh, which would just, all we do is, I think, for now, because we can't do the Tinker's Armour without upgrading this, is I think we'd just smelt a load of iron um, and actually make armour. I think that might be the, the best step, and then we can do some, some proper mining maybe next episode, which also could lead to us finding more lava. Maybe that's the plan. I think mining next episode is the plan. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying these videos and I will see you in the next one.